Okay guys, so this is going to be a really quick overview of the concept of three-point lighting. So if you come from a photography background or a lighting background, this is going to be very simple for you and you could probably almost skip it. Um, but I'm just going to quickly explain it for those of, who are not familiar with a basic three-point uh, light setup because I'm going to be using these terms while I'm compositing uh, CG. So um, these are the terms. Uh, three-point lighting is just kind of the standard, a standard lighting setup that people use uh, that typically looks pretty good. Um, but it's also, it refers to the main light sources in a scene. So if we have three main light sources, uh, this is kind of what the standard lighting setup would look like. Uh, and our brightest front facing light source would be our key light. So this big uh, blue light on the front of this ball. Uh, we have a fill light, uh, which is our kind of secondary shadow filling um, lighting. This could also be a uh, light that's bouncing off of the ground, so it doesn't necessarily have to be a light. For example, if the key light is a sun and there's a gravel ground underneath, some of the light will bounce off the gravel and create a fill. So if we're talking about fill light, we might not actually be talking about a light, but rather just the fill, the light filling the shadows. And then we also have a rim light, which is just a light that's usually behind the surface and it creates a little bit of a highlight and silhouettes uh, our object and usually looks pretty good. So if you guys take a second, go open up Google Images and type in uh, three-point lighting, you're going to see really good examples of photography, um, you know, three-point lighting. I can't use a lot of those pictures here because they are copyright, but just take a Google Images, three-point lighting, check it out. Uh, but this is, um, so if, for example, if we take down the fill light, uh, you'll see that our, we see a lot more shadow. So if I'm talking in the composite and say, okay, there's too much fill light in this area, that's what I'm talking about. Um, or if I'm saying there's two, let's bring up the key. If, if you hear me say the term, uh, let's bring up the key or bring up the key light, that's what we're talking about. We're talking about the main light, uh, which is usually direct light source, like I said. Uh, and then we also have you know the secondary light, fill light, just going through these uh, captions I made. Um, sometimes they're different colors. You know, you can see I made this one blue and kind of red just to add some color contrast, which adds a little bit of interest. Um, it really depends on the scene, depends what's being filmed, if we're trying to create a mood or something. Um, and then our rim light. So it's kind of what I just said. So that's really just a basic three-point lighting. Um, so if you hear me saying those terms, uh, that is what we're talking about.